Hey guys, this is Layla coming to you from my car. I pulled over, um, not driving, because I don't like to shoot videos and drive at the same time. Uh, knowing me, I would, uh, I would definitely crash my car. So I wanted to cut this video today because I was thinking, I was driving down the street and I'm listening to Todd Falcone, uh, little black book of scripts. I believe that's the CD and it's just fantastic. Very, very, very good. But I wanted to cut the video for you guys because I think people leave a lot of money on the table. They, they leave sales on the table because they are afraid to ask for them, first of all, and they don't create any kind of urgency. So I wanted to talk to you guys about how to really create urgency when you're speaking with someone and ask for the sale. So I was thinking, you know, we have in our specific personal team, we have um, some huge reasons for people to take action immediately. You know, they, they, didn't, they do not want to sit on the decision and think about it. You know, you really want to incite the fact that they need to take action immediately. Otherwise, they're going to be missing out on a lot of opportunity. So how do you explain that to someone? Well, the best way that I find is especially if you're if you're using a, a system where they benefit from the other people that are coming in. So if you have a compensation plan where the sooner that you get involved, the more spillover that you have or the more likely you, you are to have a superstar underneath you rather than on top of you. So that's something that you can really explain to people, you know. Hey, this is a binary system. So the sooner that you take action, the higher up in my organization you'll be. And you can leverage, you know, we leverage all the time some of the leaders that we're bringing in. You know, I am, I'm just about to give uh, Mary a call. She is a huge leader in XYZ Company. So you're really going to want to take action on this now rather than having her above you in the team, you could have her below you. And these are the kind of lines that you want to bring up and you definitely want to use. If you're talking to a superstar, you want to leverage that uh, with all the other people that you're talking to. So that's one, th one way to create urgency. Also, you can create urgency with the, just the simple momentum that you have within your team. So because our team has grown, our personal team uh, with our primary business has grown to, I think it's at 1,268 reps in 90 days. So w what do you think the downline looks like of the person that took action immediately? You know? And, and painting that picture for your prospect is really, really important. You know, you want to you wanna show how much growth we've had in just a short amount of time, how many reps we've signed up in just a short amount of time, and, and be specific to whatever your circumstance is. You know, well, we've signed up 1,200 reps in 90 days. So do you think there's some momentum there? Of course, of course. So would it not be better to take action now with the growth that we're experiencing than waiting and having 1,200 more people above you that could have been below you. Yeah, well, let, let's get you started. You know, these are the kind of these are the kind of pictures that you have to paint for a prospect and don't just let them off the phone. Don't just let them go, you know, okay, I'm just gonna talk to my wife about it and I'll talk to you later. No, no. You have to at least, if you're not going to ask for the sale right then and there because of whatever reason, you know, maybe you resonate with the fact that, you know, they have to make a decision together, fine, whatever. But leave, leave them with that sense of urgency. You never want to just let them go. You always have to fear of lost them. You have to take it away. You know, well, I, great, I can appreciate that you need to speak with your wife. When... Can we discuss this next when you two will have talked it over? Eight o'clock. All right. Now, at eight o'clock, please, if you're not going to be able to make the call, at least give me the common courtesy of letting me know so that I can schedule someone else in that spot. That line. That line will 
automatically put fear of loss in their mind. Okay, well, if I don't make it at eight, she's, she's going to schedule someone else in. This girl does have momentum. This girl is signing people up. You know, you, you want to make it seem like you are busy. Even if you're not, even if you're not, even if you have nothing else to do at eight o'clock, you know, you, you, you should have other things to do at eight o'clock, but really, really, you have to create that urgency. You have to fear of loss them. And this is the most important part. Okay. And this is the part that a lot of people miss. Ask for the sale, ask for it. You know, if they're giving you buying signals, if they're asking questions, if you're picking up on their interest, ask them. So when are you looking to get started, Joe? Well, and then, then you'll get their objections. At least then you know what their objections are and you can, you can handle them. And then after you handle them, you know, ask for the sale. So let's get you started. Quiet. Ask for the sale. Be quiet. Ask for the sale. Be quiet. Answer an objection. Ask for the sale. Be quiet. That's, that's it. That's as simple as it is. You know, the first one that speaks loses. And that is the old, one of the oldest sayings in sales, but it still rings true. Ask for the sale and be quiet. So how quickly are you looking to make a serious income on the internet? Be quiet. It works. It works. I'm telling you, you guys are not, you're not asking for the sale enough. You're letting them go and you need to stick to your guns. You really need to. So hopefully this was a little bit insightful. I'm sorry if I went on off uh, on sort of a raving rampage here, but I was really, I really inspired by Todd Falcone's CD and just really wanted to get that value out to you guys so that you realize how not leaving out fear of loss and, and not having the urgency is costing you money. It's costing you money. Not asking for the sale is costing you money. And with the momentum that our team has, you really have to run with us. So from Toby and Layla, Toby's out in Maryland, I'm in Tampa, um, but both of us really want to wish you guys all the success. Get in touch with us if there is anything that we can help you with your business, uh, or if you're interested in learning what we do, feel free. Give us a call, shoot us an email, find us on Facebook, we're everywhere. So from Toby and Layla, we'll see you guys at the top.